morning, everyone. Um, for those of you who don't know Van Eck, definitely Bitcoin, I would say, is in my blood. And I say that because Van Eck is, uh, was founded in 1955, but we also started the first gold mutual fund in the United States in 1968 before the big inflationary run-up of the 70s. And it was illegal for Americans to hold gold bullion at the time. I get why Bitcoin, I get why freedom. Country's got to look to the future, and the future of the country is in cyberspace, and Bitcoin is, in essence, cyber Manhattan. So the way you back the dollar is you buy Manhattan for pieces of paper and trinkets, and you buy it before it's worth hundreds of trillions of dollars. The United States owns the majority of the gold in the world. The U.S. federal government owns 28% of the land. You know, in the United States, the U.S. government should own the majority of the Bitcoin in the world. So what we're looking to do is to, um, is to uh, sell stock for general corporate purposes, including possibly the purchase of more Bitcoin. Oh, wow. I'm a huge supporter of Bitcoin. I was here a year ago at the other Bitcoin conference. I went home with most of my wealth into Bitcoin, so <laughs> I'm fully committed. Made a cryptic video in the Patreon explaining how to buy into strength when to dca and i've showed you guys this charts before i feel like btc is putting itself in the position right <laughs> i mean the cycles just line up so perfectly guys we got the one two three and now we're at phase four and everybody is is looking at like you know this could either go two ways i want to make it clear for the bears out there right maybe you guys get your double triple top that y'all were looking for but just based on cycle history this tells us that we this this could be one of the biggest setups for the next stage where we can see BTC hit all time highs. And I believe the same thing will happen with Ethereum now that we got the Ethereum ETFs. And you see all of these guys, what are they talking about? They're talking about loading up on Bitcoin, loading up on crypto, how Bitcoin is the future, how crypto is freedom. So if you see wealthy people standing in a line right they're standing at this line all trying to get their portion of btc is it not obvious right is this not the obvious play at hand and a lot of these cats are older we're not talking about no young cats here we're talking about older keep people buying in into the bitcoin and crypto hype right this is I don't know what to tell you guys, man. This, in my opinion, is like a, a generational transfer, a generational opportunity. And if you miss this opportunity, you could be sending um, your generation back, your family name back. This is how important this crypto cycle is because the next crypto cycle, we may get some type of crazy regulation or compliance and we won't have this volatility, right? So in that video, and I'll go over a few things, guys, um, because I... Uh, again buy into strength right buying into strength right um to be very very clear and i've made a video about this right you want to buy tokens that are outperforming btc outperforming eth um in a bullish cycle which means right the easiest way to look at it like okay which cryptocurrencies are being used each and every day was well, very very simple solana ethereum base ton right and then if you want to take it in and take it into a deeper dive, well, what does AI need? What well, needs data? Why do you think Jasmine has been one of the top performing blue chips in the space, right? So you don't necessarily have to be a DJ to make money in crypto. You can buy spot, hold over time, but you just got to make sure you're buying into the strength of the market. And I just gave you guys some tokens that's been outperforming ETH. Casper is another one, guys. Casper is another one. They're calling Casper the next Bitcoin, right? Solana is the biggest casino in the space. Ton has the ability to onboard millions and billions of users because of Telegram. Coinbase is the most respective chain, um, not uh, respected. <laughs> Coinbase is one of the most respected exchanges in this space, and they even have a layer two called Base, and their main goal is to onboard new people into crypto and new developers onto the chain to build. So 
I'm excited, man. I'm excited, man. Just hearing a lot of these speakers talk so good about BTC, talk about crypto. And it, it, and you can say, oh, well, they're talking about crypto to make to kind of like pump their bags. I get it. You know what I mean? Everybody wants to pump their bags. This is crypto, right? But at the end of the day, you can't deny what blockchain technology could be, what BTC being a reserve for the U.S. dollar could be, right? We're also seeing Fed cuts across the world, right? Not just in the United States. You know, people are predicting that we're going to get this Fed cut. 87% chance um, that we get a Fed cut. And now <laughs> a, a 0.5 Fed cut is up to 12%. So this could be insane. We've seen China do it. We've seen Canada do it, guys. You know what I'm saying? We'll know a lot in five days headed into this um, this FOMC meeting. I will put this out there as a warning, though, right? We do have an FOMC meeting, and usually we get a bit volatile. So if you were looking to DCA, I would wait to leading up to the FOMC meeting because we do the same damn thing every time, right? We pump into the FOMC meeting, then we dump. We dump because maybe Powell is too hawkish. Maybe he says something about the economy, right? And then eventually the market prices in what he says and since we're in this bullish trend, we go back to pumping. And I guarantee you, all over the space, YouTube, Twitter, even in the Discord, once we get to FOMC meeting and we dump, everybody's going to be saying the same thing they were saying two days ago. Oh, the market is dumping. Oh, the market is dumping. That's when you buy. That's when you buy, guys. Look at the sentiment chart. If you would have just bought when people were unsure, when the crypto sentiment was 465 and you just load it up on altcoins, you'd have made a whole bunch of money. Even now, the sentiment is 72. You load up when the sentiment is low, right? As long as we're in a bullish trend. This does not work if we're in a bear market, right? You might want to short the market. But we're in a bullish trend. Load up when the sentiment is low. When the fear and greed index last month was sitting at 30, right? Because we went up a few days, but last month it was really 30, right? Um, It was lower than this. It wasn't 46, it was 30. That was a beautiful time to buy into altcoins. You could have loaded up on so many altcoins, guys. So many altcoins last month. And if we go to the month, you can look at some of the strength. Soul up 32% on the month. ICP up 17% on the month. XRP up 24% on the month. Tau, which just got just landed on Grayscale's portfolio, is up 27% on the month. And then you got these cat coins and meme coins that's up on the month as well. So again. I mean, it's not rocket science. You buy in the red, take profits in the green. If you are a long-term person, then you wait, you, you take profits, peak bull run. Right? If you're trading, buy in the red, take profits in the green. Buy the low, sell the highs. Very, very simple, guys. Um, so I like to use these these indicators, right? These 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 market sentiment um, indicators. You know, I don't like to buy in the green. I like to buy. When it's fear, right? Um, if we just go back here to the uh, Bitcoin season chart, right now, right now we're at that inception point that we always dip down to when it's a perfect time to buy altcoins, right? So watch. We're going to hang down here. People are going to be scared. Oh, it's Bitcoin season. Oh, altcoins are getting wrecked. And then out of nowhere, it's going to explode just like we've seen here in November 2023, right? Which coincides with what? Q4. Q4. So you had this huge move last Q4, and we're preparing. We're at the same damn spot. Like, you can't make this up. We're at the same damn spot, guys, right here. Same damn spot going into Q4 and Q1, 2020, uh, 2024, right? Q4, Q1, 2025. This is a major setup for altcoins for what we would call the next leg up. So, Look, I'm not going to give you any specific coins in this video. I wanted to highlight some of the elites and how they feel about crypto. But the lo global liquidity is increasing. Everything around the board is looking good. All we need to do is get this last little baby black swan event out the way. Because I, I said it. They cut, if the Fed cut, stock market crypto is going to go down at first, right? Because this is what they do. They play mind games, which is a psychology thing, right? Let's shake a few of those people that, that ain't supposed to be millionaires. They ain't supposed to make it to the finish line, guys. We're going to make it to the finish line over here. But everybody ain't going to make it. Because I noticed that a lot of people in crypto is too emotional. 
right? They're just too emotional. Anything that go down, oh, it's dumping, oh, it's dumping. Anything that go up, oh, it's pumping, it's pumping. They don't know when to take profits. They don't know how to find entry points. They all over the freaking place. Develop a strategy, right? Develop a strategy. Develop a strategy that works for you. People who don't plan, plan to fail. And this is easily, this market is easily a cash cow if you just pay attention. That's all you got to do, guys. Pay attention and assign your time wisely, right? Figure out what type of crypto person you are going to be. If you don't got time, don't be a DJ. Simple as that. Buy spot, hold over time. Buy blue chips, less volatile tokens, hold over time. If you got nothing to do in your, in your life and you're just sitting around and you're looking, you know, man, dang, I got a little money. I ain't doing nothing. Create some content. Like, stare at the screen. Look at the little squiggly lines. Learn TNA. Get in Telegram. Get in these groups. Ask questions. Put yourself in the position to have first movers advantage and you'll never lose in quick crypto, guys. You'll never lose in crypto. But the biggest thing I see is that People can't figure out what type of crypto person they want to be. They don't know if they want to be a degen. They don't want to know if they want to be like their favorite YouTuber. They don't know if they want to buy blue chip. They don't know if they want to stick to exchanges. They don't want to know if they want to uh, use DeFi, DEXs. Like, stop. Go touch some grass. Develop a strategy. And stick to your strategy. Develop a entry strategy. Develop a exit strategy. Understand what you're buying, right? Buy what you understand. Buy things that are being used daily because they have a use case and some of these projects may even generate revenue. I, you know, I was on these live streams and people would be giving me tokens and I'd be like, well, what's the reason for you buying that, right? I mean, memes is different, right? You can get in part of a, a good community in a meme coin and it could change your life, right? You can, get, you can build a, a up your bags in meme coins meme coins are different but when it comes to these utility tokens that have every monthly overhead weekly overhead you got to be sure about your investment you got to be sure guys because you work hard for that money you work hard for that capital so let the words otherwise be sufficient um, i'm gonna close out the video with this i don't want to make it too long i just believe we run out of time guys we run out of time I think we're one step closer to an explosive move in the entire crypto space. It's your boy Crypto Millie. Like and subscribe. Let's get this video 300 likes. We need to spread the word. Consider some of the links. I got a Rocket X Exchange link. That will be in the description if you're into cross-chain swaps. You can earn a little bit from the cross-chain swaps by using my uh, referral link. And also, if you use crypto.com or if you want to create a crypto.com account, you can use my referral link and earn 50 bucks from using my referral link. So all of that will be in the links, in links in the description. All right. I'll catch y'all in the next one.